Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, I am here with my twin sister, Morgan. In case you didn't know I had a twin sister, I do have a twin sister. <laughs> and um, we haven't done many videos together. So today we're doing a get ready with me. This was Morgan's idea. Yeah. So we're going to our godparents house because it's our godfather's birthday. And it's mm -hmm. also Canada day, which is so cool. I'm so proud to be Canadian. Okay. Always sanitize your hands first. I already, I already washed my hands, it's cool. Okay. This is kind of weird for me because like I've never actually done my makeup in front of a camera and like because I'm so used to always standing close to a mirror. So for primer, I'm going to use a Laura Mercier Radiance Primer. I'm going to start off with my brows. I always start off with my brows. So I'm going to use the Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade in Soft Brown. It's kind of dark for me since with my light hair, but I've had this for like a year now. This stuff never runs out. Like I swear it. I started re-watching Avatar The Last Airbender, which is my favorite cartoon, sh cartoon show ever. I watched it when it was on TV, but I didn't start it from the beginning. I watched um the majority of it though i didn't i just didn't see like the first few episodes like almost like the first half of the first season and then i saw um simply kenna's tattoo collection review and she got a tattoo of the airbender symbol and i was like oh my god i have to rewatch the show because i've been wanting to do it so yeah i started watching it two days ago i'm already on season two episode two yeah i'm watching the grass right now and i'm honestly obsessed like i'm already on, almost on season seven like, I'm talking about the OG, like, Next Generation. Not the 1980s one, but the one after. And it's so good. Oh, my gosh. I got my friend into it. Like, she came over and we watched, binge watched season three. And then after that, she just started watching Can it after. Brush, my face brushes. I'm using the e.l.f. Oil-Free Foundation. One pump. Because um, when I wear less foundation, my, vo my voice, my face gets less oily. I like rubbing in this foundation with my fingers a bit first. And then going and blending it in with the brush because i think it makes the foundation look more skin like if i rub it in first this is also the first time me and taylor do our makeup together because like i don't actually like watch taylor do her makeup like I've, i watch her videos like obviously but like other than that like this is the first time we're actually in the same room doing our makeup together no because like even when we go on vacation together like our, our family we do our makeup in different rooms yeah. okay then after i always cover my brows and i'm using the concealer and corrector light six color palette from bh cosmetics this was ten dollars at winners and it's honestly so good i've like hit pan on two already the green i really like to conceal blemishes and stuff and the pink i use sometimes for under my eyes for like darkness and like the purple under top a lot <laughs> <laughs> don't interrupt me you can talk about you don't have to talk about every product man make more i don't know how i'm supposed to like i bought it. the elf gel eyebrow kit yesterday and they only had one left but i really wanted it because my my other brow powder because i only have one eyebrow product well i have another one but it's not that good for eyebrows God, but anyways it's open. finished and i got it it was the only one left and it was in light so i got it i would have preferred like a brunette color like a darker one but i really need a new eyebrow product and i'm gonna dye my hair um like blonde towards the end of the summer anyway so it should match i'm gonna try the Ugh, i don't really like gel okay i'm just gonna use a powder Okay guys, um, you're all probably gonna think, well, this is like way too light to cover your brows, but like when I blend it out, it looks completely fine. So don't worry, it looks really light, but like, also cause I'm actually like in proper daylight. I never show my eyebrows on camera because I find eyebrows really boring and it takes me like 10 minutes to do my eyebrows. It's just taking me longer cause like I'm holding it. Like I'm so used to just like doing it in front of a mirror. Like I never have to like hold anything. This color, ugh. My God, it's so red. Let me see. Yeah. Okay, I'm wiping that. <laughs> it's very under with like a... I'm literally wiping that off my eyebrows and I'm just gonna go in with the brown gel. But yeah, it does take a good amount of time to do your eyebrows, depending on how you do them. Cause some people already have like naturally gorgeous eyebrows. So for my eyeshadow, the star of the event is going to be this H&M eyeshadow I bought. I bought Taylor two eyeshadows yesterday when I went to the mall because I'm so great like that. Oh, Jesus. Oh, it's so hard to open it with nails. Gosh. No, I'm actually joking because every time Taylor goes out, she always buys me stuff. So I'm like, you know what? I should buy Taylor something too. So this blue eyeshadow is called Mediterranean. It's literally Mediterranean without an N, which I just found so weird. But this is it. I don't know if it's going to go into focus. 
such a nice cool tone blue okay i hate oh, i fucking hate gel <laughs> okay so i'm gonna two. go in with yeah, gonna bold and edgy and i'm just gonna mix those two two colors two colors to put in my crease oh wait okay i'm gonna do the gel and set it with the powder oh my god now it's time to go in with this eyeshadow i'm so excited like i've been i bought it yesterday but like i've been so looking forward to using it yeah for a while after i finished school like after our semester was over like the winter semester i just felt like i was in like a makeup funk because like i just always did the same makeup looks all the time and i was just so bored with it but now i'm really getting back into makeup which i'm so happy about Oh yeah, I just sprayed my brush with the Mary Badescu Rose Water Spray, so it comes out like more pigmented. Oh my god. What? I forgot to on my <gasps> eyebrow with concealer. Oh my gosh. I didn't fill in my other one. That's nice. It's so beautiful. Oh my god. Um, shook it! I'm just gonna go back in with the blue. Like, all I did to blend it out was I just used the same blender brush I used to put the brown, and I just went back in with the brown to blend it out some more. I brushed my eyebrow hairs up. So they look like Gigi Hadid's. Like all feathery and it makes your eyebrows look fuller. You don't brush your eyebrows hair up. Bra uh, eyebrow hairs up. Yeah, I do, but you just can't tell. <laughs> what? That doesn't make sense. Well, because I like to put on a lot of product. Yeah, but you put eyebrow gel last. Yeah, I do. Yeah, exactly. So how does it not show? I only realized today when I asked her what kind of makeup, she, like the way she does her makeup, we do our makeup in completely different orders. I don't know how you do, I can't do my eyeshadow bef like after I put foundation because like I'm too afraid of fallout and messing up. I just have to do it before the skin, like I just have to. Yeah, but I brush my eyebrow hairs up and it's just like putting foundation on your eyebrows is just more complicated for nothing. Me no laggy. Okay. Eyeshadow primer. Did you even put eyeshadow primer on? No, I just said it with the freaking, uh... You just put eyeshadow on your lids? No, I said it with the white eyeshadow. Said what? My lid, duh. Yeah, but what did you put before you put the powder? Just concealer. I don't like that. I find it doesn't work well for me. Okay, I'm, I'm taking so long because I just want to, like, blend it towards your broken nail. Shoe. Oh, yeah, okay. I, I told Taylor today before we started this video, I broke my nail. I'm going to show you guys. <clears throat> these are my nails and my pinky broke and i don't even know how i broke because yesterday at work at both our works it's like this new policy where you're not allowed to like have fake nails or like wear jewelry or whatever so we have to wear gloves now and the gloves oh my god my hands get disgusting all sweaty and gross. i don't wear the gloves i'm a rebel yeah too there's a rebel like that but i do because i don't want to risk getting a fine or whatever so I literally put my gloves on, like my nails are completely fine. And then I put on the gloves, I swear after like two hours of work, I take my gloves off, my nail is completely broken off. And I'm telling so where did it fall? I don't know, but I, I said it couldn't have fallen in the food because I was wearing gloves. So that wouldn't have made any sense. But like, whatever, the mystery of my nail will remain a mystery. Okay, I'm gonna use the Laura Mercier Radiance Primer. Usually I use the e.l.f. Poreless Primer also, but I forgot in my room and I'm just too lazy to get up. <coughs> <coughs> Oh, for foundation. Wait, let me talk. Oh my I'm gonna god. Because I'm putting one eyeshadow on my lid. Okay. I'm just taking this cool tone brown called Put In from the Too Faced Semi Sweet bleh, Too Faced Semi Sweet Palette. Put In. It's more like it's supposed to be like pudding, but there's no G. I know, but you say Put In. Put In. Put In. I would say Put In, like pudding. Put In. This Laura Mercier Silk Cream Oil Free Foundation. It's in medium ivory, and this is amazing. This is full coverage. Like, oh my god, like this can cover anything. It's so good. I never used that brush. Like, I bought it, like, cause it's an Elf brush she's using, and I bought the same one. I like it. I like it too, but it's like I just hey, forget that I have hate, it. Hate, hate, hate. That's what I always say to Morgan. Haters gonna hate, 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 cause she hates a lot. Oh my god. Now I'm just using, oh crap, what's it called? The Becca Aqua Luminous Concealer. I think that's what it's called in the shade. What shade is this? Light. Since I did my prom videos, and I put a lot of concealer in those videos, I like the way that looks better now. So now I put a lot of concealer. 
Well, I always put a lot of concealer, but now I put like a shit ton of concealer. I always put on, like, look how much better my face already looked. I used to bake my face every day, but then I stopped because every time I took pictures, I got like major bad <laughs> Like, it I, was looked, so funny. I looked like a ghost, and it was just awful because, like, I'm so yellow toned, but on the camera, I would look like Casper. Like, you don't bake anymore? No, I stopped. Mm -hmm. I'm like, I bake sometimes, but, like, when I know I'm going to take pictures, I don't. Hey, can you not be all like me? <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna use the Physician's Formula. It's the three set bronzer, the matte sculpting thing, and, <laughs> and I love it so much. It's so good. It was, I thought it was pricey for drugstore. It was $20, but I love it. It's so good. I'm just going to use the same shade on my lower lash line. Let's talk about being twins. I feel like people are always fascinated Ugh. with twins. So, why don't we explain to they them? They could just go watch Ethan and Grace if they want to know what it's like to be twins. Oh my god. They're such better twins than us. You'll so. never know. <laughs> okay, let's just start for me. Okay. So I just want to say that like a lot of people ask like being twins and stuff do you hang out and stuff because like the way I say it is just like living with your best friend because like even though we don't spend a lot we don't spend a lot of time together <laughs> we don't spend a lot of time together when we're home together because like we're just always doing our own thing but like when we go out and stuff like we're always together like we always do everything together besides like with our college friends because we know we're in college now so like we obviously honestly I'm a <laughs> honestly I never see Taylor at school like do you ever see me. No. No, like we literally we go to the same school. I didn't have a girl. I hope you're not grossed out. No, no, no. We go to the same school and I swear to god we never see each other. Like ever. So it's like the only time I ever actually see her is when we're hanging out or like at home. Everyone always associates Taylor with like the makeup trend, but I do makeup just as but well. But what would you Taylor. expect? I do makeup just as well as Taylor. Like you can't deny. I'm not gonna lie, I think I'm a bit better at makeup than you. <laughs> I do. <laughs> yeah, Taylor's like with eyeshadow, like she experiments more because like I just like to experiment with different colors. Like, I'm all about doing colorful eyeshadow. I get so bored of doing neutral smoky eyes. <laughs> <laughs> I don't do neutral smoky eyes. <clears throat> AKA Taylor today. I get really bored of that. Like, I get so tired of it. Everyone's always like, oh, you don't have to get so dressed up. But, like, bitch, that's who I am. <gasps> so, like, I get Slay, honey, annoyed. Slay. And I get, like, kind of embarrassed. So, it's like... Pussy stunning. I freaking love Makita Dragon when she says that. I just want to show you this eyeshadow I bought yesterday. How is it random? I don't, I don't know. Just changing topics. But like, <clears throat> I, fuck, it's so hard to open these with nails. Jesus. Okay, here. It's this green eyeshadow called Avalon. It's the same. Don't use God's name in vain on my channel. <laughs> Mother! The <Yeah>. curse! <laughs> Okay, so it's called, I don't know if I'm going to be able to put it in focus. It's called Apple. Bronzer! And it's so beautiful. Taylor, how pretty is it? It's this color right here. I don't know if it's going to be in focus. Yeah, because you're showing it to me. It's so beautiful. Beautiful green. I'm obsessed with green and blue eyeshadow. From what I bought Taylor green and blue eyeshadow also. Different shades, obviously. And her reaction was so funny when I came home and bought it to her. She was like this. Oh my god, I can't believe you bought me makeup. Mm -hmm. Okay, I took the BH Cosmetics blush palette and I'm still debating on what blush to use. Um, I think I was going into fashion because I just can't afford it. Yeah, okay. I'm just going to go in with like this very new. You're blocking my face. Oh my God, sorry. Yeah. It's a really big palette. Okay, but I'm just going to go in with that really light nude shade. It's going to take me a really long to edit. My inner corner, I'm going to do this emerald green color. It's in 212. It's a Kiko eyeshadow. And I just want to show it up close. Oh, it's isn't the most gorgeous thing you've ever seen. Oh, it's so beautiful. Okay, so my top and my trousers are both from Zara, and I freaking love them. This was only $9, and it was a steal. Ignore the mess. <laughs> my top is from Topshop. My jeans are from Topshop. My gold hoops are from Claire's. I'm serving such Latina vibes. This is the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for getting ready with us. I really hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you loved having Morgan here. I loved being here. <laughs> Hopefully, um, I can have her, you know, a few more times. Mm -hmm. um, follow us on Instagram. The links will be down below. Subscribe to my channel if you enjoy my videos. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed <laughs> Get Ready With Me's. Thank you again so much for watching, and we'll talk to you soon.
Bye.